Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Arya's Story. In the last episode, we found all the juggling balls in the comedy section and pressed onwards, and we ran into the narrator, and she gave us more cryptic nonsense. And now, for the most part, it looks like we're basically just trying to find a bunch of card suits, so that way we can press onward. And in this room, basically, one of these dolls... I'm guessing has the next card we need in it, but one color lies and the other one doesn't. And honestly, I'm starting to think it may be the purple dolls that are lying. Cause like, after looking around on it, honestly the yellow dolls have signs that seem a bit more consistent? I don't know. So let's give it a whack. So they must all be pointing to the right doll, so... We're all pointing this way. This one's pointing up. So, must be like one of these three, yeah? You know this is the doll with the hidden object? Yes? Ow, that hurt! Nope. You think this is the doll with the hidden object? Nope. There's a card on the floor. There we go. Ace of Diamonds. Let's go save. I think that was a clown body. And I don't know how I feel about that. Actually, I know exactly how I feel about that. Deeply fucking uneasy. Okay, so how many cards is that? Okay, that's four. So, from the looks of it, we need one more. I'm assuming there's a room further up these stairs. Yeah, same. Okay, let's just see what's in here. Hello. Welcome to my humble abode. Win a wonderful prize. It's simple. All you have to do is play a little game. Let me explain the rules. I guess I have no other option. See these doors? You can enter whichever you want in any order, but when you enter them, you must solve a riddle. The answer will be something that you can find in the room. If you don't know the answer, try examining the room around you. So those are the rules. Simple, ain't it? I'll be waiting for you in the rooms. Oh boy. Okay, so... Hmm. Which door to pick? Well, he said any, so let's start with green, because that's my favorite color and I'm shallow. I don't know. Let's see. I have many legs, but I can't keep myself up. What am I called? Uh... I don't... Will I die? Okay. Okay. Good. Okay, so let's examine the room a bit. Gift. I may not have legs, but I can keep myself on my toes. Hmm. A broom. A plant. A tombstone. A clown. A chair. A gift. Clock, treasure chest, and a lamp. I guess out of all of these, wait, is there anything here? No. I guess out of all of these, the one that makes sense the most is the broom. Because it talks about having many legs, and I guess that would be talking about, like, the bits of straw? So let's see what happens. I have many legs, but I can't keep myself up. So yeah. It has, like, lots of pieces of straw, but it can't hold itself up. So... Correct! Wonderful. Very well done! Wonderful, I guess I just have to leave and, like, do another one. Alright. 
Let's do blue next. Okay. I'd be very upset if you couldn't solve this, you know. Remember which and remember that the answer lies in this room. Okay. Uh I am the key to knowledge. I create new worlds. Some might find some find me entertaining, others boring. What is my name? I get the feeling I know what it is, but let me just like make sure that option is like in this room. It's just a candle, a chair, a gift. Well, hmm. None of these seem like they make sense, but would a book technically count since our host is a book? Because, like, that's the only thing I can think of that fits the bill. So, let's see. Yeah! Well done. I mean, yeah, the technicalities, I guess, but still. We got it right. And here's the last door. I don't think I'd love to have the answer to this riddle close to me. As I grow older, I get smaller. Do you know what my name is? Uh... No, I don't. As I grow older, I get smaller. Clock. A gift. A chair. A candle. A clown. A treasure chest. A lamp. A tombstone. A plant. Uh, it might be the plant? Or it might be the candle, but let's try the plant first. Actually, no. I mean, I guess plants shrivel when they die? So let's try plant first, unless we, like, fucking die. Actually, no, wait! The, uh... Our, our, our host said that they wouldn't like to have this answer close to them. And I mean, candles are, like, on fire most of the time, so... Yeah! Good job. That's all of them, I think. Oh! Never mind, there's a red one. Secret bonus challenge? May I remind you that the answer only lies inside of this room, even if you cannot see it right now. Hmm, would you like another hint? Not right now. I can break myself into millions of pieces yet still work, but if I stop moving, so do you. else in this room. I can break myself into millions of pieces, yet still work. But if I stop moving, so do you. And the book was really obvious about how the answer is always in the room, even if you can't see it. And I mean, we are here, so... The answer... Yeah! We did it! Well done! Can I have my gift now, please? Congratulations, you solved all the riddles. Here, your prize. You've earned it. Yeah, Ace of Hearts! 
you can not only learn from books, but also have fun with them, right? Yep, that's why I love books so much. Aw, now you're making me blush. Neat. Okay, let's head on back. No pun intended, oh god. Uh let's just let's just, let's just go back, save, and then do the thing. Okay, so let's see. I guess do we use them? Nope, we can't align ourselves with like each one, so Are we supposed to use them with the carousels? Yeah, yeah, okay. So Hmm. I guess I just can put them in any order. And if we can't, we did save, so I feel like this may be a hint, actually. I'm not sure, though. I mean, <laughs> I know this is a shitty way of. Oh. Okay. Alright then. Uh. I guess I'll put the club in here. Nope. Ace of spades. There we go. Ace of diamonds. Motherfuck. There we go. And then ace of diamonds. There we go. All the windows opened. So let's save again. Real quick. Also, I did not notice that there were, like, fucking stairs up here. Just seems like Arya has roughly the same thing to say about all of them. So I wonder, does this open up now? There. Okay, let's see. No? Does that mean this opens up now? No, it's it's locked. So what good did that do? Oh wait, there's a door here. Huh, I'm smart. <laughs> there are teddy bears here. I don't think these were here before. Well, here's a new book. So let's see here. Chapter two. Fairy tales. Hmm. I am. I do. I gotta admit, even as an adult, I do have a bit of a weakness for these. Let's see. Oh, verb. Hello. And now there's something in its beak. Is it a letter to Hogwarts? For me? An invitation. <laughs> to Hogwarts? Thank you. Let's read the invitation. You are formally invited to the party on the third floor. We look forward to meeting you. Ah, nuts. I wanted to go to wizard school and not do a thing that fucking makes me wildly uncomfortable. So let's see. Let's just, like, have a little poke around. Let's see what all is on this floor. Hmm. Nothing here. There's a bowl of soup on the table. It seems delicious. Do you want to drink it? Can we have some delicious soup? Is it good? 
Well, nothing happened then. We just had some go- Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, no! You, you kids know your ner- you, you, Oh, no, there's a book called Goldilocks and the Three Prayers, written by Robert Southey. Oh, no! We need to go. We need to go before the bears get home. The doorknob is gone. Oh, no! Goldilocks had been more careful there would they and would have never found her. Oh! Alright. I guess I had that coming for breaking into somebody's house and eating their delicious soup. Alright. Well. I guess we need to be careful what, what fucking... Hello. A silly monkey toy. Aw, oh, it's gonna kill us later, probably. The door is locked. Hello. Do you want to play with me? Uh, sure. Let's play rock, paper, scissors. Uh... Rock. I use paper. That means I win. When I play with other books, it's always a draw. Let's play again on some other occasion. Okay. I'm glad that was just a harmless game of rock, paper, scissors. These were the first books I read when I was little. My love for books started thanks to them. Aww. Oh, look who it is. Hi, narrator. She wanted to escape from this mysterious library, but was not in but it was not an easy task. Did you know that many fairy tales deal with dark subjects? I find them very interesting. Sorry, I do not wish to distract you with idle conversation. I'm sure you're busy. What's wrong? Can I ask you something? Of course. Is this the first time you've narrated what happens to someone? <laughs> hmm? Are you waiting for an answer? I said you could ask, but I never said I would answer. Hmm. Eh, that's unfair. The silence disappointed her. Instead, she decided to continue exploring. Is that you predicting the future, or is that you telling me to fuck off? Because either way, yeah, sure. Lots of fairy tales. Horsey. So let's see. Seems to be about it. And she won't let us go through this door, which is great. So let's say one more time and see if we can do anything. Involving this room. I figure we could like hide in the closet or something, yeah? Instead of Goldilocks had been more careful, they never would have found her. So I wonder. Can't help but wonder. This bookshelf is like not shelf, uh, cabinet. Cabinet is here, and it's vaguely bit big enough to contain somebody Arya's age. No? Do I just have to drink all the soup? No. Well, shit. Do I have to go in here and sleep on one of the beds? Nope. I wonder then if we have a chance to like run? 
when when it's when the bears when the bears come forth let's find out nope rad okay so I guess we'll figure out what the hell to do next time on Let's Play Aria Story. I will see you guys then, and take care. Thanks for sticking around till the end. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like, a comment, or maybe even subscribing and hitting that subscribe bell. If you want to see more of my content, there are some recommendations for you on screen right now. See you soon!